Hey, this is Russ. I want to show a new product to you. Well, it's not new, but it's new to me. This is the Ember Temperature Controlled Mug 2. This is the 10 ounce version and it's in black. So we're gonna unbox this and then I'm gonna use it for a while and give you my opinion of the product. So let's just take this apart here. I'm going to remove this side panel and they have the Ember logo on the top here. I don't know if you can see that though. The box is very heavy, I'll tell you that. The cup is pretty heavy too. This is, uh, this is actually battery controlled. So uh, you can use this for, I believe, up to an hour and a half once it's been charged up. And there's an app that you can put on your phone and that'll control the temperature. Let's see what else is in here. Um, okay, well we have the charging plate. And of course with that, there's gotta be an AC power adapter. So I'm just gonna keep taking this apart here. Some documentation, we'll look at that in a second. Yeah, there's, a, there's an AC power adapter here. So that's gonna plug into that AC power plate. <laughs> Put that down here. Let's take a look at the documentation. See what they give us here. Actually it looks like a CD uh, case almost. Uh, Ember logos, I guess this, these are some stickers you can help promote them. <laughs> um, typical disclaimers, warranty information, that type of thing. And startup manual tells you how to get this thing going. Uh, basically the, the cup is going to be um, controlled from your, from your phone. And um, yeah, this, this is gonna be fun to try. <laughs> give me a couple of weeks, I'll come back and give you my report, but it'll be on this video. Stay tuned. Well, I am back. I thought this was going to take a couple of weeks to go through this to make this review. Nope, took a couple of days. <laughs> So I had a chance to try out the cup and uh, the cup, yeah, the cup doesn't quite work. <laughs> you know, it worked actually for a while. It, it actually worked for uh, three cups. <laughs> but by the time we did the fourth cup, it wasn't holding temperature. So I'm gonna show you a photo right over here. This is a photo of uh, the cup not working. Now, we compared this directly to what the app said, 139 to 140 degrees. It, it even said that uh, we were right on temperature. But if you take a look at the Thermalworks Thermapen Mark IV, you're gonna see that this thing is not 140 degrees. <laughs> and this continued on throughout that entire time. So it's not a fluke thing, it, it just stopped working. It was fine up until the fourth cup. Now, here's a couple of things that we noticed with this. You know, you have the, the charging base, all right? And then you have the cup. Now, charging base is fine. Uh, if, you, if you left this on here the entire time, this thing would be charging the entire time. Um, so essentially not using the battery. But the battery really only lasts between an hour to an hour and a half. They claim one and a half hours, but really it's less than that. And um, it's, uh, you know, for a, a cup that's about $100, <laughs> It should be working more than four cups of tea. If you if you put the liquid in there that's actually less than the desired temperature, the, the cup tends to try to heat it up and it takes a while to get to that level. And as it happens, it just keeps draining the battery. So you don't really get your full hour and a half. Now, if you put too hot of a liquid in there and you want a desired temperature lower, it will just allow it to go lower and, and it will indicate too that it's, it's, um, it's, it's working. In other words, it's not doing anything. It's letting the temperature drop, all right? So if you look at the cup here, I'll put that down there, um, it's, it's glowing red right now. The, the red indicates that you need to charge it. And of course it's been sitting for a while, so it's, it's not charged. And while you're charging it, it blinks red. Now, if it's a solid white, it tells you that you are at temperature. 
and if it's blinking white, it says it's getting to temperature, so it's working there, okay? But again, if you look at the photos here, you're gonna see that the thing is solid uh, white, which indicates it's at temperature. And the app will tell you, uh, I think we had it between 139, 140, something like that. It actually tells you we're at temperature, but if you look at the Thermapen, we're at 117 degrees, <laughs> we're, we're not at temperature. And it sat there at 117, so obviously it isn't working. So the cup is going back, it didn't last long. Um, like I said, four cups of tea, I don't think that's worth $100, so back it goes. So is this a positive review? Nah. I, I would say it wasn't <laughs> a little bit of a disappointment, but hey, at least um, you know we got this thing on Amazon uh, and it's going back. So they don't have too poor of a policy to re return something. They're okay with that, and, and their returns are relatively easy. You know, if you don't even want to pack it, you just bring it unpackaged, put it back in its original box, and uh, bring it there, and they'll take care of it for you. So at least that's good. Anyways, if you like the video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit the bell icon so you can see more videos from me. I'll talk to you guys next time.